Alright guys, I'm going to change that power into assembly on the outside. Disconnect it from the... I'm going to disconnect that over there. Take that, I'll take this smoke pipe off. That's black and that's white right here. I was off. We just have to pop this thing out, put the new one in, reconnect it, and redo so. Just three wires, white, green, black. Power going out there. Well, we hook these back up after. All the weights go back together. See it was all rotted out. Okay, put a piece in there. The original, original thing was all rotted out. We have to grind these off. These were put in with a with a hammer. the other one to get it out. Something wasn't in there. I'm going to take this plate off it to get it off because of the hole. I'll we'll have to do the same. That's a stainless one. That's a better unit. I'll take this plate off. And I'll stick it in. There's a plate that goes on the back side. I gotta fasten it in with some anchors. I'm gonna just use some of these plastic anchors. Got a hammer drill here with a quarter inch bit, that's all you need.
right in there. Put my bit on my thing and we'll screw them right in. You can see I had, to, I had to pull that collar off to get it in because it's tight. But I'll, uh, I'll slide this on and then I'll put that collar on and get it. You can see there's a damper in there. That's how you set the, the draft if you have to. There's a damper. Alright, I got my piece. I put some anchors in there. Attach that quarter inch couple in there. And I put this wire around like this so it's, it's got space here so it doesn't heat up. I'm gonna keep the wire away from that. And the wires is just neutral. Positive, neutral, and ground coming in from the fan. This control operates everything. Pre-purge, post-purge. Um, when the power venter runs, it pulls this vacuum switch in. Power comes up to this control, runs this unit. If this vacuum switch don't pull in, it trips the reset. So all I have to do is I'll have to button this up, fire it up, and check the draft. I'm concerned about the draft over the fire. Is what my concern is. You don't want to have too much draft. If it's too much draft, I can adjust it down with that damper inside there if I need to, or this, um, this damper here. It's not firing. I'm gonna see if we're getting any oil out of here. Let's see if we're getting any oil. Getting oil.
Obviously, it didn't fire up the first time. I don't know why. We'll try the nozzle. We'll see. Might get a little puff out of that. We'll see. I'm going to turn it on. We'll see if it fires. Fire it up that time. I might have had a bad nozzle. Check the draft over the fire with the power vent running. We'll see what it is. Hey, that's that's too much right there. Watch. That's too much. That's like three inches. We could open this up more. Oh, we could close the vamp or one of the two. Let's try it now. That's better. Still a little much. Oh, you can see I moved that a little bit. I kind of shut it a little bit. Let's shut the damper. It's about right, right about two inches since one. Let's try to roll on it right there. Perfect. Too much draft and all the heat goes out of the boiler. So that's good right there. You can see how that's been all rotted. The guy, after I left, he had put that that plate in there until I could get by with a new power venter. It's supposed to come out this little spot right here. But it was all rotted. It was, um, you can see it was rotted all the way around. So, um, I had put a replacement motor in this back in the day. And, um, Sometimes I'll put like a patch plate if it's rotted out, hold the motor. You can see it down inside there. I had to put a patch plate in there. It was time for a new one. And you can see the damper adjustment here. I got it upside down so you guys can see it. It's upside down. Usually that's on the bottom. And then you could adjust the damper um, to slow the flow down, whatever you want it. Usually it's probably halfway, it depends. If you need more draft, you open it up all the way, but usually it's halfway. Uh, it depends on what, 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 the, uh, what the setup you have is. It's 4 inch, usually it's 7 to 4. Um, they do make a 5 inch one, which is a bigger, bigger unit for more BTUs. Seen better days.